Jay, you be careful and don't break that china bowl. Oh, I guess I won't hurt it any, Nancy. Well, you'll be careful. Say, Henry, stop that step ladder up here, will you? All right, Josh. Say, Ty, did you ever hear what made old Lige Willis quit drinking? No, what was it, Josh? Did he join the temperance piety? No, they took away the fence between his house and the grocery store, and darn fool didn't have anything to come home by. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Nancy, whose picture is this? Why, Robin, that's a picture of Hiram, my first husband. I always hang him over the mantle. The sheriff ought to hung him first. <laughs> <laughs> Josh, the way that ladder is slipping. Well, I know you'd do it. You broke that china bowl. Poor Hiram used to keep his tobacco in it. He was such a powerful hand to smoke. Poor man, he's been dead 30 years today. I suppose he's still smoking. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> Josh, that looks like it might have been a pretty good razor one day. Esri, you put that right down. That poor Hiram's razor. And she was so particular about his shaving. Yes, he could shave a bargain, close as anyone I ever see. <laughs> well, Nancy, we got the table stopped, so we might as well have dinner. That bread looks as if it was piled in the baking. You can't bake bread like my first wife, Nancy. You don't finish the dough my first husband did, neither. There's only six of us, Joshua, and the seven chairs. That's where Hiram always stops, and I keep his chair there for him. We shall meet, but we shall meet him. There will be one vacant chair. We shall linger to a Won't anybody have a chance to miss him while Nancy's a living? 